Fora TV. The world is thinking. There's a well-known American show. Some say that it was a, uh, a game-changing show called Breaking Bad. How many of you are familiar with Breaking Bad? I don't know that many. Anybody in the audience know that show? Not that many. Very unusual. Do you know that show? Yes, I do. You do? I've never seen it. Never no, seen it? No. I'm familiar Jesse? with the name of it. Right. Karen, just, oh, just well, give I'm an idea of what the, name the story is. <laughs> <laughs> I said it first. <laughs> Karen, this is taking yeah. a really quite uh, difficult subject. Yeah, well, that subject matter is a, a guy who, um, uh, you know, is a chemistry professor, uh, finds out he's dying of cancer, doesn't have any money to support his family, and decides to um, go into business with a younger guy and open a methamphetamine lab. And that's, that's the theme for the that's show? That's the theme of the show, but um, played by the genius Brian Cranston, who was in, um, you know, uh, uh, what's that wonderful show uh, with the... What was it called? Hi. Thank you. Um, and, uh, you know, like The Sopranos, uh, it's, it looks like, and even like Nurse Jackie, it looks like it's a, a, a drama, but, you know, it's really funny. But Sopranos, you could have pitched it like some schmo from New Jersey, you know, with the family, has some bad business dealings, and possibly a mother is driving him nuts. <laughs> you, know, that, you know, that's the comedy pitch. So it, it, what's happening a lot in America on the edges of American television, which is the cable networks, um, uh, it's that that's the stuff where, where we're all interested. We, we blend in our minds. We, you know, we're all fluent, that's what I was saying. We're, we're uh, bit by bit um, rebelling against being uh, ghettoized into just doing comedy three gags a page like it used to be from the sitcoms. We used to have uh, network executives with you know, literally looking at a script going, Tick joke, tick joke, tick joke. Wait, that's only three jokes. There should be four jokes a page on this. You know, where's the where's the fourth joke? So that's where we all started, and now uh, the the comedy is subtler because we're living in a more, I think, absurd world. So if it's trending anyway, I think in America it's trending toward blending of the two because the jokes are richer.